Three little girls at the ages of one, four, and five are left without their mom and dad after an alleged drunk driver slammed into their car earlier this week, killing both parents. The driver tried to leave the scene, but police caught up to her. She is a 22-year-old Newport Beach resident. She also recently had a DUI arrest. The driver is in custody. CBS 2's Orange County reporter Michelle Geely has more on this effort to help the sisters financially. Hello? How you doing? Home from the hospital and surprised with dolls, games, and toys. Como estas? You okay? Como está, como está el spaghetti? We were invited to share the joy with the three young Santa Ana sisters who survived a violent wreck that took the lives of their parents in an alleged DUI accident a week ago. 22-year-old Grace Coleman from Newport Beach has been booked in jail for murder, hit and run, and driving under the influence. It's just so tragic that this had to happen. But I mean, I mean, I'd rather not be in this situation, have my sister-in-law, my brother here. But um, I mean, at least my girls are okay, and I gotta be strong for them. We all gotta be strong for them. Their aunts, they're here. I got a lot of support, and I mean, that makes me happy. But um, I mean, so. It's, I mean, it still hurts. Help for the family has flooded in from far and wide. Donations to GoFundMe accounts have climbed to nearly $430,000. Santa Ana police came to the family's mobile home this afternoon with their arms filled with gifts, bikes, and a giant stuffed teddy bear. Emma, Elena, and Samantha in little casts wrapped around their broken bones were all smiles. Checks from the police management as well as the police officers association were delivered. We want, uh, you know, just to express uh, that we uh, see them, uh, that we care for them, and that we love them. Uh, they're part of our community, and it's not just about, you know, a few toys today. It's what we can do for them for the foreseeable future as well. Extended family members will be caring for these three sisters. Burial for their parents will be happening in Mexico. In Santa Ana, Michelle Gialli, CBS 2 News.